There are two alochas in the Rambam. The Rebbe said that the way to bring about it, that everybody should say at Mosai the way he's supposed to say it, that it should come from himself, not only because he's told to say it, is to learn the Yonik Gula Mashiach. There are two alochas in the Rambam. When he speaks about Vias Mashiach, the aloha in, in by the way in the beginning of Perg Aleph, the Mish Ainu Maimi boy, Mish Ainu Mechakele be also that somebody doesn't believe in him and he's not awaiting his coming. It's not enough just to believe that Mashiach is going to come, but you have to await his coming. Mechakele be also, and he puts the puts them both, both in that the Mechakele be also he puts it in the same category as the Maimi boy. That if you're not mechakli biyase, so so let me shine a vim levad to kafeil, but tell you, but Moshe ben Yekafeil and everything, you have no shaykes. That's one halacha. But then in Perek Yud Beis, there's another halacha where he speaks about whether the yo is going to come before, the yo is going to come after. <coughs> and he writes over there that there's a machlokes rachomim in this. And they don't have a kabbalah with dvarim elu. If you hechra psukim, if you hechra yesh lemach leikus with dvarim elu, there are going to be other details of how the gedul is actually going to happen. But upon him, ain't see the havayz at dvarim elu where they do kaim ikav bedas. The order of these things and the details of these things is not an ikav bedas. The ve'olam yis asiga adam ve'odiv ve'hagodav ve'yach ve'droshes hamuris ve'nyonim elu kiyets v'hem ve'esim ikav. That a person in these matters exactly in the details. Like, for example, whether the yo is going to come first or later, but other, the other details don't make that a main point of, uh, of B.S. Mashiach. And why is it not an Iker? Because exactly the details of how it's going to happen, because they don't bring not to years Hashem, they don't bring to Avos Hashem. Await, don't make it that has to, when, dates, etc. That's not the important thing. The main important thing is to await his coming and to believe that he's coming and that he could come any minute. Uh, and, and the chlolis ha'inyan of Gula, that the Gula is going to happen, Mashiach will come and will be in his gala. That's what we have to believe. That's what it means, the chakra will be yosu. So when the Rebbe said the raising in Yonah Gula Mashiach, according to these halachas, it's a posh, it, we have to be raising in those things that strengthen our emuna in, in the Etzim Gula, and that Mashiach is going to come, that the Gula is going to happen, and that we have to strengthen ourselves in the Lechakis Lebiyase, that we have to await his coming. And awaiting the coming, so <laughs> I just want to read a Tanya in Perik Mem. Well, there he speaks about which is connected with the Pashas Shavua about somebody that has a rotzi to be the Hashem, to be the with the Abishter himself, and to become one and to come to Avos Hashem. And he has a gvald getzimoyin to become dovug by Kodesh So he says that. Uh, how can you satisfy your thirst to come closer to the Abishter by through the Mehatero? And somebody that doesn't that doesn't it's not satisfying your thirst through the Mehatero, Niglach, see this. So then is Moshe Mahadovadayma has a Kamisha Aimed Benor with say, Mai, Mai. It's like somebody is surrounded with water. Water could be that you could drink from, and other that could that you could satisfy your thirst, that you could be and you're surrounded with this water and you're not drinking, but you're screaming, my my. In other words, I have this simoin, I want to be dovik with Kodish Bohu, I want to be in Sachid with Hakodish Bohu. I want to have, have this kaloyin la Kodesh Baruch Hu, and have around me a lot of water, a lot of things with which I could be miravid this simoin. So it's like somebody that's screaming water when he's surrounded with water. 
כפי פשוטה, שאין אמור בין למי שהוא יצא ממסעיו ללמוד, פשיטה שילמד מעצמו, ולמה לא ללמוד בדיצק? about learning itself so then why Kurdish Bohu and he thinks that the Dovik HaKadosh Bohu he has to do oyster delicious things you have the Torah you have the Chesidus you have exactly what was given to you with which you can become Dovik HaKadosh Bohu and if you don't do those things you're looking for other things so then it's like somebody that's surrounded with water and doesn't want to drink and they ever said that everybody has to start screaming at Mosim it's at Atzma that you have to be Mechakli Bi Osli and you have to do whatever, and if you're mechak so you're going to do whatever it is necessary that you should be able to come. And otherwise, when the other way, if you scream at Mose, but you're not doing what you what you could do, so this at Mose is like somebody is surrounded with water, and he's screaming water, and he's not using the water that he's surrounded with. We have the sikhs, we have the memorium, we have the kola teru kula, we have teru mitzvahs, we have the hadrochis that the Rebbe gave me, of exactly what has to be done and how it has to be done and which way it has to be done. And just to scream at Mosai without doing those actions which are our control, which are totally in our Prirachovshi, so it doesn't work. That's that's not at Mosai, that's not real at Mosai. It's it, it, it the, the falseness is 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 is, is screaming out. Or in, in simple words, the, the first sikhs that the Rebbe gave out in the Dvar Malchus that came out after the Sikh of Chof Ches Nisan was the Sikh of that the concept of Mashiach, Mubusis on the Rambam, the concept of Mashiach is that, ma, that is Malchus, the Malchus of Beis Dov, the Yoishno is the Loshno of the Rambam that is Yam, the Hach the Malchus Beis Dov, the Yoshno, the Mshog, the Shoyna, the Mikdim, the Kabbinit, the Chesay, the Chesay, the Kola, the Shpotim, the Yomov, the Koshoy, the Koydim. Et cetera, all those things that we can't do today, that when Mashiach will come, we'll be able to fulfill the Torah that the simple words the Rebbe is saying, but the Rambam is saying that the concept of Mashiach is that at that time you have Shlemus HaTorah Mitzvah. The Torah is what Abishra gave us, the Kalim, through which we can transform the entire world to make a dear Betach to, to bring about the Gilei Lekus in the world that we want to see, that that's what B'yaz Mashiach is all about. And that's the definition of Mashiach, Shleim HaSater V'Amitz. Or in different words, like the Rebbe said many times, that we went into Gaul as Mabnei Chateinu Galinu Ma'atzeinu, and if you want that there should be the Gaula, the only way to bring about the Gaula is that we have to move out of the Sibit. So one of the things that the Rebbe stressed many times, that the Mavatu the Siba of Golis, so just like the Golis came because, because of Sinas Chinam. So the, the, the how to bring about the Gaul is to is to work on our Chinam. There shouldn't be any machloikis. There shouldn't be any machloikis amongst Eden. There should there should be an av for every single Yid and to try to help every single Yid in any way that I could help him, but Gashmias, to Avas Chinam. The, 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 I don't have to have a Siba and I don't have to have a reason. It just the very fact that this is a yid and there's something, and, and so therefore, as a yid, I I have the total ava for him, ava shleima for him, and I but and ava is that I'm a sapi called tzrochov and I want I want to kirva I want I want I want upon him upon him etc. So that's been adam lechaveru and the same thing has been adam lemarket. Since the Indian of the Kus that at that time will be in his Gala the Kus Ba'ilam Yedako, that the whole world will be filled with knowledge of Yediyas Hashem Bechuli. So, whatever I can do to increase my Yediyas Hashem, to show my how I really have the Simoin for the, for, the, for the way the world is going to be after Mashiach will come, I have to do whatever I could do right now. And whatever is my Yechoyas, whatever is my Pchir, it's a, it's a Tzchoyk. To just go on with our everyday behavior, uh, that uh, the Golistic behavior, and to say, but I want Mashiach. If, if we have to do whatever it takes that Mashiach should come, so the way to whatever is in our power right now, to Mechazik and Torah Mitzvah, so that's what we have to do. There's the non in this in this week's Pasha that the Rebbe asked the question. That how is it possible that there should be Rotsi and Shuv? If the Rotsi is Be'emes 
when he has this simoy in, in this kaloisa nefesh to the abishter, and it's the emes that he just he wants to become ois. So how is it possible that when he comes to the ultimate epitome, the seed, the, the, the highest point of this of this kaloisa nefesh, that then all ones do I have to go back down? It's a tie to the sas. So the Rebbe explains that it depends how I'm going into the Rotsi. If I'm going into the Rotsi because Kiris the King lead to if I'm going into the Rotsi because of my personal Rotsi, because that's what I want. So then, Taka, there's a steer. I have this Rotsi, I want Kaloisa Nefesh, I want total Dvekis, Bakadish Bok, a little Gonj, a little Nefesh, with Dira Lane. And this, this, this Tnua is because of my own rotten, because of my own chukka, because of my own want, my own want to be at that level and to be separated from 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 the, all these narishkeiten of the world. But it, I'm, what I'm thinking about is my own shleimus. So then there's like a stira. How how can I when I come to the sea and I come to the ultimate highest level of this rotten that now go shuv go back down. And, 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 and become another physical human being dealing with the physicality of the world around you. I, that's, that's not what I want. And uh, when I come to the sea of it, how, can I go, how, can I, how is it possible for me to go back there? So the Rebbe, so the Rebbe explains very simple that it says, like it says, the Losh Rebbe Kiva Nichnam Shalom is Yotzev Shalom, that if my drive and my push to, to, for the, the curious of the Kiva Nichnam is because of my own shukha, because of this is what I want, this is what, the, so then Taka, there's a steering that's impossible. And the only way that you can really f- 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 to come to the shuv, which is the ultimate tachlis of Bias Eilom, the ultimate tachlis of Ayman and the Shoma came down into this world, is if the Rotsi itself is also because that's what the Abishta wants from me. The Abishta wants me to, ha- to have this shukha, the Abishta wants me to have this simoin, the Abishta wants me to be in this alder and to have this, 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 this terrific, this kaloi sanefesh. And since my whole drive was the rotzen of the Abishter, so the same Abishter that told me to come to this level of kaloi sanefesh, of this rotzen, the same Abishter says that when I'm at the ultimate epitome of this rotzen, now shuv, now for, to utilize these spiritual capabilities, this gidli kus that he got through the rotzen, utilize it to transform the world and make the world the way it should. And, and uh, but pastures is the same thing as with Bias Mashiach. If you want to accomplish real Bias Mashiach, what am I oisig in? What is it that I want? Do I want Bias Mashiach for my own perfection, for my own my own neuchius, my own comfort, my own um, my, because I want the world to be exactly the way I uh, that it should be in this perfect way, that, and I want to live in that kind of a world? Or I want Bias Mashiach as part of my shlichus over here in this world. Just like the Abish, just in order for me to be able to accomplish I have to first elevate myself and separate myself from the physicality of the world around me. And only then I can I be mishtalit and can I uh, utilize and transform the physical world around me and make it into a dear betachtenim, a place which is muchan for, for, for the Abish to be there, that the Abish will be comfortable over there, because that's what's going to give me the koiches. So it, it, the same thing is with Bias Mashiach. Bias Mashiach could be, I, I, I could, I, we should have Levi, like the Gemara says in Sanhedrin, he wanted to beat Mashiach, he wanted to greet Mashiach. He asked Elio, how can I, where can I greet Mashiach? And Elio Novi gave him the address. And he went and greeted Mashiach, and he asked Mashiach, when are you coming? And Mashiach answered him, Hayyim, today. The day passed by, and Mashiach, there was no his gallows of Mashiach in the world. Mashiach was there, Mashiach is Kayim, but the opinion of Bias Mashiach is Galas of Mashiach in the world. So he came back and met Eli Yohanov and again said, Mashiach is Badoihu. He told me he's coming today and he's not coming. So Eli Yohanov answered that Hayyay means Bekele Sishmo. That Hayyay means in Bekele Sishmo. I, Mashiach himself, didn't make any transition. He didn't make any Katnai. Mashiach just said Hayyay. How, how does Eliyahu and Novi come along and say, no, what Mashiach meant, he meant together with the condition of him, because it's So So the simple answer is that Hayyayim is the way the Abishter makes the Yayim, for the purpose that the Abishter makes the Yayim. Otherwise, it's not the Yayim. 
how you aim the day the way the Abishta wants to be the day, and how the day the way the Abishta wants to be, that's only in Bekodesh Shemot, it's only through our Avoido, that the Zman and the Mok and whoever I am, and whatever, whatever opportunity was given to me and was utilized for the way the Abishta wanted me to utilize it. So then when we do our Tafkid, so, so every Yid has a Nitzvah of Mashiach within himself, he connects himself with that Nitzvah of Mashiach, that he realizes that everything is a shlichus of the Ebrister, and the, the shlichus of the Ebrister of Bias Oilam is right away from the beginning was because he wanted a dear betachdenim. And the way to make a dear betachdenim is that everything goes according to the way the Ebrister intended it to be. And he gave us a clear. That's why he sent down the Neshama, Nefesh, the Chelik, the Kai, the Mal, that it can be Megale, the Kus, the Oilam, the Agashvi. And how can we be Megale, the Kus, the Oilam, the Agashvi? For that, we have Lama Tes Krochim of the Gutesiches. For that, we have 30 and some krochim of Igris Kodesh. For that, we have all the memoriam of the Rebbe. For that, we have the, the whole Teres Achsidus that right away is in Zgala to, to try to be Mekarv. And that's what we have to, be, to put ourselves into. The Rebbe went a step further. That Avada Yid has to be a Sholem and And our first dig is that all Yidin should be exactly the way they wish they wanted them to be. But we, as Yidin, we also have a responsibility for the whole world. And we have to see that, that even the Havdal, even Goyim, they have to, they're Mekai, they're Sheva Bitzvah, and everybody that has Hashboy, any Koyach that a Yid has, that, that he has, that he has to sack and do, utilize his Koyach, the sack and oil, the Shin Dalad Yud, he has to utilize it in every way, not only in his little corner, because I'm not only thinking about myself, and I'm not only thinking about Klaali so, I'm thinking about the Rots Navayit. The Ratz Navaya is that this is the second Eilam of So therefore, if I can have a Hashpah and a Goy that he should keep Sheva Mitzvah and Eich, I should do that also. So if I say Ad Mosai, and I really want Mashiach, and I really want these Galas of Mashiach, and I really want that there should be a model or it's Deus Havai, Kamai Miyam Rechasen, that's what I want. But then there's certain things that I can do right now. Zoom around, I say Toiv. So the first, if the atmosphere is real, so that's where the first expression of this atmosphere has to be in what's totally in my control. And what is totally in my control? Myself, my sviva, wherever I have hashpur, to utilize it in the full way that I could have the hashpur over there and to do it over there. That's the very shooting. That, the pastors, that's also the difference if we say Admosai, but I'm not going to say Admosai, like the expression that you ever said. Or I say Admosai because it's coming from within me. What's the difference? We do mitzvahs because we're told to do the mitzvahs, or do the mitzvahs because we, we want to do the mitzvah because of the Nasa of Nishma that we said at Harsina. So, so I'm not holding right now. I have a Yetzirah, and I don't want to do the mitzvahs. But I'm, but I'm told to do the mitzvahs, so I, I do the mitzvah. So the Chur is very good. I, I, did, I did whatever I was supposed to do. The answer is that when I do what, only because what I'm told to do, so I do it according to what I, my understanding, what I'm being told to do. When I have my own shukr, and I want my own vacus for Devishter, to be Mal de Rotsen of Devishter, Mal my Shlichus over here in this world. So then I can't not be mistaken. I did, I was Yaitzi. There's no such thing as Yaitzi given. I have another, like the Rebbe used to express, you have now another minute, you have now another opportunity. Do whatever you can do, Mitzat your Kaychus. It's not, you're not being Yaitzi for anybody. You're doing because this is where, what my home at CS is all about. If the atmosphere doesn't come from within me, see, you're not understanding the atmosphere. Because the befrat, and if by me there is there is not that shukr to, uh, to be malin and to fulfill all my kriches and all my abilities according to what I could fulfill, so then I don't have the real atmosphere. What's the union of Mashiach, Shlemus Atteva Mitzvah? Just like this Shlemus Atteva Mitzvah Bechlol, there's the Shlemus Atteva Mitzvah Befrat. And everybody, if I'm utilizing my kreches and sur miram, and I say to you, according to my ability in, in the full sense, and utilizing every opportunity that the Ebishter gives me, and I utilize it to the utmost of what I of my understanding, so that is what the expression of Atmosa. Because that's where, where I'm living. I have a shlichus over here. And that shlichus over here is mamish negeya. 
And it's not get it's not get to it, it, it to myself. It's not get to the world. It's not get to the Eibush Kavi Yochel to the Eibush himself. He not vay nitzav alav. Like the Rebbe explains in many sichas, that the Eibush himself is maniyeh chal yenu tachtoni umabit alav abeich mekloyz alav moiv dekuroi. That's what we have to live with, and realize that by the very fact that I'm here, whether whether I feel it or I don't feel it. The Matthias, the Matthias advert is, I am here, this is where I am. <clears throat> and I have an opportunity to do something, you know, say to you, or, or, in, in whatever opportunity. So that is my shlich is right now. That's why the Abishu put me over here. And that's why the Abishu gave me the krechus, and that's why, the, and, and, and gave me the ability to be able to utilize this in the best way possible. <coughs> We shouldn't be fools and start being icing in those things that the Ram says in Paragud Bays that it's not the Ikaradas, it's not it's not the Ikarador. We have to understand that what we have we have we have what we have to work on, what we have to put our efforts in, and what we have to try to put our understanding in is what will fulfill the Mchakila Biosli. How can it be expressed the Mchakila Biosli? That when a person is really waiting for something, so then as the time goes by, he doesn't not only doesn't his his muna and his become weaker, the other he comes more anxious because he realizes that's a whole metzia. So why isn't this metzia being fulfilled? And so therefore, when he becomes more anxious, so like the Rebbe says, the, the, the pit, one of the pizgom that the Rebbe constantly used was going mechayil choil, not to be satisfied with it. Not to, there's no, there's no. As long as Mashiach is not here, it, I can't give myself a pat in the back, no matter what I did, no matter what I accomplished. Accomplished, I could do this with mitzuris, bechuli bechuli. But Mashiach is not here, so obviously there's something more that has to be done. Maybe another point that could be brought out is the nature of people is that I what I did already, what I learned already, what I accomplished already. So okay, so that's done. I have to look for a new challenge. Like I heard somebody say that obviously there has to be something totally new. There has to be something totally revolutionary because otherwise, whatever was done was done. And we can't compare ourselves to the Mereshenim Kamalotim Onu Kabane Odom and Mereshenim Kabane Odom Onu Kabamim. So we, we can't compare ourselves to the earlier generations, the way they learned Torah, the way they were, they were Makai Mitzvahs, the way they had hours of soul, et cetera, et cetera. We're not in their Madayuga, we're not like the Chsidim Mereshenim. So therefore, what is it that I can already accomplish? So people think they'd have to have some, something revolutionary and have to think of something revolutionary. No, it's, oh, that's the only way I can accomplish. So even though that ain't no chinami tak, we have to go like the Rebbe said, and that we have to be like Kenan and Sagabi Anok, and we have to reach out to places where maybe in previous generations didn't reach out. We have to accomplish certain things that the opportunity there is in our generation, like the Rebbe had also the Kabbalah Sheva Mitzvah Bnei Noyach, that once upon a time was impossible because it was kosher sakonis and kosher to do such a thing. Nowadays we can do it, so we have to do that. Uh, just one example. So, so obviously there is there, there are certain things that are left for us to do, but then there's another point. The, like the Rebbe says, by, when it comes to Sphir Sa'emir, we all say Yom Shlishi, or Yom Revi, or Yom Asiri, that now it's a new time, a new day, a new Raveda, etc. We say Shlesha Yom, we say Ava Yom, Asari Yom. That means whatever previous Aveda was accomplished, we have to keep it. And we have to build on top of it. Whatever was done for that Mashiach should come, for these gals of Mashiach, etc., etc. It's not that since Mashiach didn't come in Chas Vashon, obviously that's not it. No, there's the there's the there's the yom echon, there's the shnei yomim, and there's the shleishi yomim. So whatever whatever is was done, al pi the way we're supposed to do it in mitzvah and all the other things, we have to stay with that. We have to not chas v'shalom be mivatel it. 
The Abishta gave us another day, so now it comes Arba Yomim. We have to have those Shloisha Yomim. The Shloisha Yomim have to stay in whatever was accomplished, and those Shloisha Yomim stays with us. And it's there, Kedusha is kind of Oilam, it's not, never in his battle, and that's the Pshat of Nanas of Gabi Adnok. But uh, since we now we are in another day, so we have to add another point, another Avaida, BS says BS to us. Does that mean that it has to be a total change? Not, not necessarily. What has to be is that I have to realize that I am part of that, that I am a continuation of that. And in any way that I can make sure that these things, that all these should be kayum and should be mayor in the oilam and everything that was accomplished throughout the way that, that, that there was a Venusat Fila. There was Dvekus, there was Abba, there was Avas Reim, there was a Chsidishkeit, etc., etc. All those things have to be Kayim as much as they can. I am here that even a person like me, that I, maybe I don't have the same feeling like the, like a Molech Chsidim. Maybe I don't feel the same Abba in the same year like a Molech Chsidim. To show that, even, that it could be in me also, and that I can also accomplish in these things. And when we go with the Muna Pshuta, that I'm here and the Abish to put me here. And that I'm, I find myself in this Golis and the Abish to put me over here, gave me a tafki that I have to do whatever I can do to get out of this Golis. And not only to get out of the Golis for myself, but for the entire Kali so. And like the Rebbe said, how can anybody be totally satisfied no matter what is being accomplished? When we know that as long as there's Shinto Begalusa and the Abish to gave me, put this, gave this Shlichus also to me on a personal level. Besides, as part of the club, to try to do whatever I can, that there should be shchint and that the base of Megillah should be built, and that there should be a gilelikus ba'elam. That's why I cries, and that's what the Rebbe said. It gives us ibrit zayich. I just want to add one, one, one more word. I, I'm sorry, Rishakha, to my time is up. To just have, what? Huh? We're on a we're on a time we're half an hour is. All right, they run out of time. I just want to say just one second, one minute. 